The Rhode Island Department of Transportation is going green. Beginning next week, the department will reduce highway lighting on three local roads in an effort to save some money and the environment. Green Team reporter TJ Del Santo joins us now with the details that are new at 5.30. The reduced highway lighting test begins next Tuesday night. The goal? To save some cash and reduce light pollution. In 2009, the Rhode Island Department of Transportation spent $1.9 million on highway lights. Overhead lighting is our biggest item, cost item, uh, in our maintenance budget. To reduce that expense, the DOT installed 50 timers on street lights around the state to shut the lights off at certain times of the night. Saving money, making our transportation dollar go further, uh, stretching the dollar. And secondly, it's a part of a uh, going green initiative to reduce greenhouse gases. Three stretches of road will see the lights go off at night. Route 4 between exit 8 in East Greenwich and Route 1 in North Kingstown. Also, all of Route 403 into and out of Quonset Point and on Route 6 through Providence and into Johnston, including the 295 interchange. Safety is always our, our first priority. The DOT has reviewed the reflectivity of the signs and pavement markings in these test areas, and they say they're all in good shape. The lights will be off between midnight and 5 a.m., except on Friday and Saturday nights when the lights will go off at 2 a.m. The state expects to save at least $400,000 with this new system. It could go towards snow plowing, it could go towards uh, uh, maintenance. If this trial works well, other state highways could see the lights go dark as well to save even more cash. I'm T.J. Del Santo, Eyewitness News.